Hey there everybody, Pop on Top here. Welcome back to some more Fallout 4 mods. In today's mod, we have the Doom 3 Super Shotgun. We just recently covered the Doom armor, right? The Doom guy armor. We we're very much the Doom guy. And now we have the Doom 3 Super Shotgun. It's not maybe my favorite Super Shotgun design in Doom's history, but it does look very nice. Um, it's essentially just like a reskin double barrel though. It does have some chunkier noise, but it does essentially function like the double barrel loop. Or function similarly so like all the attachments and stuff are the same we'll show that off still regardless but really it's about the model looking nicer and it does look nice it obviously looks like the super shotgun and if you're wearing the doom guy armor this is the weapon to use i think i pissed the bugs off down there so all right bugs let's just show this thing off real quick hello dog you yell at the bugs real good it's a super shotgun i'm also gonna show it off in some more combat later but just wearing the doom armor with the doom <laughs> Even if it's the Doom 3, the Doom 3 Super Shotgun combo is pretty sick. It has a certain, like, vibe to it, I would say, right? We very much look and, you know, shoot like the part. So it is louder. It's supposed to be louder and more boomier than the regular double barrel shotgun. I don't know if I necessarily feel that, but that's also because I have, like, sound mods and stuff on that change the sound file. Anyway, but it is, it is a nice chunky shotgun. Shotguns are my favorite weapons ever in video games. It's, like, up there. It's like a, it's probably it's got to be number one. It's got to be number one if I think about it. So I would I do want to show off. You can craft this for yourself at the chemistry station while we're looking that up. The mod does weigh in at about forty three megabytes. So just for relevance, in case you care about that kind of thing, um, you do need you know a decent amount of components for this, but no perk requirements. And it essentially functions like I said, exactly like the double barrel. You have your base double barrel stats here, but we can show off some of the, the customization here, and that's some of the coolest parts about this. Is even though the customization is all the same. You go all the way up to advanced receiver, uh, you go long barrel or short barrel and stuff. They do look different. Like the full stock here has some writing on there. What does that say on there? Bend the hell and back. That's what it says on there. Um, you can put glow sights on there, you know, your reflex sight, all that stuff. Um, and you can put muzzle brakes on there still. Your spike muzzle brake, it still looks good. You can also put damage modifiers on it, but that's really it. Um, obviously, the stock looking has unique customization on it is cool. Um, well, I guess we'll show that off here in the pit boy. We'll examine the gun. Where am I? That's the dead wrong super shotgun. I would like the glow sided advanced one. Yeah, there we go. So we obviously have a longer barrel on here. It's like ported and stuff. It looks nice. It does fit the theme, right? It still looks like the Doom Marines super shotgun. I like to bend the hell and back on the stock. So we got that equipped now. Obviously, like I said, just exactly the same statistics and, and all that stuff as the regular double barrel shotgun from the base game but it just looks cooler like it, that's a huge factor here obviously this gun's amazing too you, people underestimate how powerful the double barrel is but like when you get that advanced receiver on then you maximize that fire rate. i really like the glow sights on this too just like a nice little red i really like the sights in general on this gun not that because you, you can never aim down sights and do them right really right like so like the fact that it has sights is good at all right and the sights are nice nice little shotgun sights but obviously you could just kind of hit fire the thing we're gonna go hit fire the thing because we're going to go shoot some stuff, because why not? And I will see you guys when we get there. All right, everybody. We are at my Zombies Arena Arcade mode. We're going to test out this Doom 3 Super Shotgun. I'm super excited about it. Let's start spawning some ghouls at the Super Duper Mart. And just kind of Super Shotgun. I just need the Doom music playing in the background. Like, even old school Doom. Like, da 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 You know? Just something. Just something to hit here. Can we, can we spawn in the ghouls, though, please? There we go. Hello, ghouls. Super shotgun time. I wish it reloaded faster too. Um, Cause that's just like how I, I remember the Doom shotgun, right? You just like really just slapping some new shells in there all the time. It is obviously effective though. It's as effective as the, the regular double barrel shotgun. It's not special or unique or anything. But I mean, it has a good time. Like I said, no no, no, no people are using the double barrel. It's too good of a gun for y'all to be skipping out on it like that. We already finished our first wave. We're going to do another wave just because I love shooting things with the shotgun. And it's very Doom, right? It, like I said, it looks the part like it's supposed to from Doom 3, which is like probably everyone's least favorite Doom. So it's not necessarily the one that I'd pick, like I said, to bring over um, to Fallout 4. But it is nice shotgun. It looks nice. It sounds nice. It has all the customization you'd want. I mean, the same customization as as a double barrel shotgun, but with the added benefit of looking cool as fuck. So, I mean, that's a big deal to me. Looking cool is a bigger deal than actually being functional. Plus, there's just something satisfying about a double barrel. Just like a lever action rifle, right? Like, just something about, like a, because the animation quality is 
get out of that. It's so much more improved. Obviously, we're just absolutely walking through things here. And it's not being a struggle at all. I mean, we could do some bat shots on deck. Just absolutely a nice that feral rule from forever away. Um, we could do some third person shooting here. Which is really weird. This is like absolutely asinine. Could you imagine like a third person Doom game? Where you're like playing like this? That's some weird shit. <laughs> like that would be weird out of its mind. Obviously the weapon does not lose effectiveness and it can function in third person. The animations and stuff all work because it uses the same stuff as the base double barrel shotgun. But it's a super shotgun. So I mean, who, who doesn't want to use the super shotgun? Who doesn't like Doom? If you like Fallout but you don't like Doom, you're kind of a weird, you're in a weird position, I think. <laughs> like, but I like it. I'm having a good time with it. I'm going to, you know, mess around with my super shotgun, my Doom Marine armor for a little while longer here. Um, and I'm having a good time with the combination. So, if you guys would like to check out this mod for yourselves, make sure to check out the top link in the description. There'll be linked there to the Bethesda Dynet page. You can download this mod for yourselves there or the Nexus mod page if you're on PC. If you guys have enjoyed the video, like the video. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. And if you guys are new to my channel, make sure to subscribe. That we can check out more videos from me. And pretty much other than that, you guys have a good rest of your day. Whatever it may be. And I'll see you in the next episode.